Hey everybody, Cypher Boy here with a new video, and we are continuing on from where we left off. So the witch master attacked the village, and now I got turned into a vampire. So, ah, oh, that guy's dead. So now it's time, I guess, to venture out. Hey, what about the other guy, the old guy? Maybe he'll be still alive. I don't see him there, so maybe he was in the town at the time or was killed off later. Let's see what the guards... Let's move the arrow out of the way. Sava Savanovic, you are not dead, but at the same time you are dead. There is something wrong with you, a curse inside you. Touched by nothingness, it is draining you from the inside, but also making you stronger. I have never seen this before. I must have it. It is powerful, dark. Give it to me. It is emanating from your mouth, from your teeth. Give it to me. Bite me. Uh... I assume if I don't bite him, he'll find some way to do it anyway, so... And I must take it by force. I must spread this curse. I am to be the king of the cursed ones. Everyone will know the name of our village. Vampire. I am now a vampire, and so are you. Okay. He's gone. Now let's see what we have. <clears throat> Haven't been this far yet. Oh, it is raining. I was wondering what that noise was. I had to stop running and you see some giant wolves in the forest. Probably better to stay on the road to Avon for now. Yes, let's go. Ooh. 50 gold. Preparing for battle. Okay. Oh, and it's... Wolf Beast. I wonder what happens when I get knocked out now. Like, that was a missed opportunity. Wonder if I would start off in the village again or actually die. <laughs> Six gold. No leads. Okay. Following this thing here. There's the road. Greenwood Cemetery. Wonder if there's gonna be zombies or something there. Maybe maybe more vampires. Peter the Eyeless. Ah, oh, traveling. Numfatum, how can I be a service? Numfatum is what the Order of Eyeless calls your regular folks with eyes. Uh, who are you? Forgive my manners. My name since enlightenment is Peter the Eyeless, an humble member of the Eyeless Order. The Eyeless Order is an ancient order, formed by Scepter the Eyeless many years ago, 
We are spread out over the world today, giving directions to people in need. Uh, enlightenment? Yes, Nymphatum. One day I woke up eyeless. I could not see my own eyes in the mirror. Cursed this day, I shouted at the gods. For weeks I sweat, thinking my life was over. And then one day I heard the calling, a whispering voice telling me to seek out the order of the eyeless. And here I am today, giving directions to lost travelers. Blind directions? How can an eyeless give directions? Do not worry, I shall explain it to your feeble mind. We eyeless are blind, but we have perfect vision, 2020 to be exact. One does not experience the world in the eyes, but in the mind. It is the mind that forms visions of reality. As eyeless, we have simply rid ourselves of the veil of ignorance that eyes introduce. Introduce. Don't know what introduce is, but whatever. Through the years of practice, eyeless can acquire visions again. That is why, my new phantom, I am the one giving directions here, while you are lost on your path. Makes sense. Ah, you pretend to understand our eyeless ways. New phantom, exactly what I expected. Okay. Uh, I have to go. Wait. Road to Avon. Just keep going northeast, new phantom. Okay, north, east, so I'm going this way then. <clears throat> I wonder if you stay safe if you stay on the road. You wouldn't believe the number of people getting lost in these forests. Maybe from that eyeless guy. Huh. Entered Avon. When I was young, I thought my destiny was to find all the brutals. When my one legged chicken beat me in combat, I realized that I should not do something else with my life. Squirrel stew for lunch again. Yummy. Hey, hey, hey. <clears throat> Please let me grieve in peace. No matter who you are or what you say, hunters are the might almighty beings. Nothing to see here. Point for some bread? Thanks. Mary. Hello stranger, could you do an old lady a favor? My son forgot his lunch when he went out hunting. Could you take it to him? Sure. Thank you. My son's name is Laddle. You can find him in the hunting cabin just north of Avon. My stupid brother just released our super special blue rat in, out in the fields behind me. It's crawling with rats there. Can you find it, subdue it, and bring it back? Thank you. It's crawling with rats, so look out. Okay. Um... Trying to figure out. <clears throat> Come on, you plants. So is it here? Or back here? Okay, maybe this area for the blue right? If you are looking for the church, you have come the right way. Just continue east a bit. A bit. Whatever happened to Rico? I heard he went into a deep sleep after his adventures. I just want to go play in the forest, but I keep hearing strange noises. Okay, um... No sighting of Vaso, son. Keep it short. Why didn't the witch, army, witch master's army destroy Avon? Next question. Keep it. Ah, uh, do you need help with anything? Yes, three deserter sergeants from King's, from the king's old army have set up tents in the forest to the north. Kill them. Okay. 
Maxim, commander of Avan's war forces, or war force. Uh, nothing. There we go. <clears throat> Wonder if I can go into churches or if I'll like burn or something, like classic vampires. Okay, so exited Avan, Avan, whichever. Let's see. Holy Frederick of the Sun. Blessing, stranger. Are you in need of healing from the sun? Uh, Church of Sun, what is that? We are the ones devoted to the eternal and never dying sun. In these dark days, the sun is the only thing we can trust to never go away. Um, you look troubled? Yes, sadly, a member of my church passed away recently. The sun will never shine on him again. Even worse is that his soul is not resting under the eternal sun here in the church. Instead, his family buried him far from our church. I need you to bring his bones back to us. Could you do that for us? I guess. Thank you, Naaman. His name is Abram. I know where his body is buried, but his grave is protected by his family aura. Find and talk to his sister, his best friend, and his neighbor. That should give you enough contact to be able to bypass the aura. You only need to say a few words and it will be enough. His neighbor lives close to the market. His friend lives close to the blacksmith and his sister lives somewhere in the southern parts of Avon. Okay. <clears throat> Calvin the Immoral. Another traveler that heard about Calvin's commodities, I presume. No, no, don't be shy. I'll look away while you change. Want to see my wares? Ooh. I like these. Uh, too bad they're so expensive, though. I really want the wings, though. Um... I want either of these two. Those would be pretty cool. I'll try to remember about that thing. 50 gold. Let's talk to that grieving hunter again. It'll at least be possibly one uh, thing off the list to do for that bone aura thing. So hungry. Harvest looking real bad this year. Do you know it's possible to attract rare wild brutals if you use certain scents? I think Ketevin has one of those scents. She is a rare, rare sight, but if you ever find yourself facing the mother of wolves, run as fast as you can. Good to know, blacksmith. Uh. Let's see. Um. Hmm. Let's do this one. Equip it. And then sell the previous one. Let's go ahead and sell the mace as well. Here we go. Simon, do you have any work for a fellow like me? Another chest. 50 gold. Just the other day, I saw a glimpse of a huge beast in the woods, biggest I have ever seen. The teeth would slice through metal like it was paper. Could it have been the mother of wolves? 
I was born to hunt. Can you smell that? It's coming from that tree over there. Being dead for quite some time, there is something written in blood here. A wild boar got me. I'm going to bleed out. Tell my wife, Elizabeth, that it was the giant beast that did it. Thank you. Okay. Uh oh. Oh no. Let's run. Flee. No way I'm gonna deal with that. I do need to heal as well, so... What am I doing now? Okay, um... Drunk Igor. Sometimes days is blank. You so you drink vodka. Um let's see. Yes, what is it? Are you Abram's sister? Yes, what do you want? Nothing. That's warm. Ooh. That swarms. Okay, that's. Here, let's see. Here, let's drink that. Mm. Okay, let's do. That one, yay. Now, vitality. Uh oh, I should have probably done the bite one. Next time I'll make sure to do that. Let's do the dodging thing. There we go. Refreshing dodge, okay. Plus two max equip load. Good to know. Kristoffs, what happened to you? You look so pale. Is everything all right? I feel terrible. I can see that. Talk to second in command, Archil. If anyone needs help, he is the one to turn to. You can find him in front of that big building over there. Okay. <clears throat> oh, level up? Oh. Oh yeah, I forgot to do that part. Let's do that one. There we go. Master Hunter Ketevin. At your service, how may I help you? As far as I am concerned, without hunting there is no Avon. Avon. The first person in Avon was a hunter and the last person in Avon will be a hunter. It's how we make our living and it's how we live by our life. There is no place in this world where you will find this fine hunters as here. Uh, tell me about the woods. All kinds of monsters and beasts are lurking in the woods. If you are looking for the wolf beast, it can be found anywhere around Av Avon. It's more common in the south, though. Last I heard about that, the rare stalker beast was that it was seen north of Avon. Can you teach me to hunt? You can only teach yourself to hunt. However, I can tell you what to hunt so you can teach yourself. Let's begin with some small prey. Kill three wolf beasts. They can be found anywhere in the woods around Avon. Okay. Yes. Did an army pass by Avon? Yes, that army passed by here. Left everything unharmed here in Avon. Don't know why. Hmm. This is meddling with things above my rank. I have neither the knowledge or the, nor the grade to be dealing with your concerns. 
You should be talking to the head of the village, Basso, although he is in the mansion, unavailable at this moment, grieving his lost son, Nicholas. His son was out hunting deer in the woods three days ago. Didn't come back and several search parties have been out with no luck. All they found was his bow. Do you see the fire behind you? They are lit so his son can find his way back to the village. A fool's hope, but still a hope. Speaking of those fires, they might be our be your way in to speak to Basil. We have four fires out in the woods. Help us make sure they are lit. And I will put in a good word for you to Basil. Or is it Basil? One of the, the fires are just outside the village, not more than 10 or 20 meters out. Sure. Okay. I think I'm going to end it here because it's getting pretty long. So I'll see. talk to you later. Bye.